The Upper Thames River Conservation Authority uses a network of hydrometric stations situated in key areas across the watershed. These stations measure a variety of environmental parameters including air temperature, precipitation, and water level. These data are used to understand the watershed's past history as well as to make predictions or forecasts on how the rivers and streams are likely to behave under different weather or climate forecasts. One parameter which is difficult to measure, but that is important to hydrologists, is the flow or discharge in a stream at any given point in time. In order to estimate what the flow rate is in a river or stream, we rely on a transformation from water level. Stream gauges continuously measure the water level in a stream at its location. The water level is measured at a set frequency, generally at 5 minute, 15 minute or 1 hour intervals, and stored in a data logger on site. This data is accessible via telephone line or cellular modem from the UTRCA Watershed Conservation Centre. To convert the water level into stream flow, we rely on a transformation provided to us from the stream gauging process. We try to understand what the flow rate is for a series of different water surface elevations measured at the same location, which results in what is called a rating table. For example, at elevation 0 meters, we could expect 0 cubic meters per second of flow. At 0.1 meters, we might expect 0.5 cubic meters per second of flow. At 6 meters elevation, perhaps as high as 400 cubic meters per second of flow. The objective of stream gauging is to fill in as many of these points to give the most accurate estimate of what the flow is for any given stream elevation. To make matters more complicated, rating tables are not constant as the shape of rivers and streams evolves with time. The elevation at which we expect 10 cubic meters per second today may well be different in a few years or less. This requires continuous monitoring and measurements to ensure the best possible information is being used for decision making. Water resource technicians make trips to the various locations in the watershed where these hydrometric stations are situated at different times of the year to measure different levels of flow. Measurements are made using a precision instrument called an Acoustic Doppler Current Profiler or ADCP. An ADCP is an acoustic hydrocurrent meter similar to sonar used to measure water current velocities over a depth range using the Doppler effect of sound waves scattering back from particles within the water column. The rarest measurements to capture occur during high water periods which may only occur for less than 14 days out of the year, though nearly always in the spring. This data, once processed, is used for flood forecasting, for statistical analysis or likelihood of flood flows, and to determine where the floodplain is located, determining where it is safer or less safe to build.